Lucas Media. So I just want to cook on something real quick. Shouldn't be a long video about Floyd and Tank, their on again, off again beef. You know, they cooled and they not, then they cooled and they not. So after Tank's biggest moment against Frank Martin, Floyd, not even what, a few minutes later, leaks out the footage of basically Tank getting dog walked by Devin Haney. You know, Tank was gassed and. Uh, he could barely breathe, and you could. He was trying to. He was really trying to argue with Bill and everybody else versus just fighting Devin. It was obvious that Devin got the best of him, right? And we all know that Floyd chopped up the footage. But my thing is, you know, I've been I've been sitting back and watching, and I know a lot of people aren't even talking about it as if it doesn't exist. But when Floyd leaked out the footage, the highlights of Tank Davis. You had everybody coming out, making channels, making comments, all in my comment section. Oh, you know, oh, look, look, Devin, I mean, Flo, Tank whooped on Devin. Tank whooped on Devin. Even though people who were there said that he won, Floyd came out and said in previous interviews that Tank, I mean, that Devin got the best of Tank. They interviewed Devin Haney right after the sparring footage, and he talked about it. So... It, it's just funny because people are just running with this narrative. But how come nobody's getting on Floyd? Y'all notice that? See, this lets me know, number one, how much y'all love Floyd no matter what he does and the hatred that most people have for Devin Haney. Now, you would think of it, right? People should like, like, I like both fighters. I like Tank and Devin. It ain't, it's a lot of stuff that I disagree with what Tank be doing, especially with him signing with Ryan Garcia when Ryan Garcia clearly popped dirty. But overall, I, I don't have no ill will towards his brother. You know what I mean? And it's just funny that people just it just act like it, it didn't happen. And then how come ain't nobody saying nothing about Floyd? It's because y'all want to get y'all interviews with him where all he do is talk about himself. This dude who's almost 50 years old just lets you know how much of an insecure hater that he is. This man should be promoting fighters. Floyd and I... The reason why I keep going in on this man is because this lets you know how much of a narcissist he is. Floyd could be the biggest promoter ever of all time. Floyd could eat, he could have every fighter you could ever imagine under Mayweather promotions. Can't nobody compete with him. Bob Arum can't compete with him. Eddie Hearn couldn't compete with him. Nobody could compete with Floyd because Floyd is a superstar. But a lot of times, a lot of these superstars are such narcissists that they don't want to pass the baton. See, it was cool when Tank had a little buzz and him and Devin and, you know, Floyd was the big homie. But who was the last time Floyd actually fought somebody? And don't come in here and talk about some Floyd fighting um, Conor McGregor. That was not a real fight. Everybody know Floyd carried him. Even Floyd admitted it. Floyd, what, Floyd fought Andre Berto. And what year was that? Uh, I think it was what September 2016, 2015. I think September 2015. That was his last fight. So people have moved on, you know. And we got the, these young crop coming up, and now even Devin them got little homies coming up behind them. So people are excited, but because all the attention ain't on Floyd, you know, Floyd starts leaking stuff out. Now you did hear things about Tank and one of Floyd made was his daughters or whatever, which that's one of the reasons why they're beefing. But again, they're on again, off again. And Floyd, as the big homie, if he really got away with Tank, he should have let Tank do him, right? You got three private jets and all this property in New York and you make smart investments, I wouldn't even worry about it. But this is what I'm saying. Floyd, Floyd's going to keep doing this. He hated on Devin Haney and y'all laugh. Now he hating on Tank Davis. What was it? He hated on Ishay Smith. Floyd has hated on so many fighters. It's It's ridiculous. You know, even Mike Tyson came out and said that Floyd snitched on him and, and he gave his reasons why he don't like Floyd. So Floyd is not a likable guy outside the ring. Now, inside the ring, 50 and 0, you, you want to have a fine, whatever, right? But outside the ring, I mean, this dude is, is tripping. So it's just, I just want to see where are people, where's the outrage that Floyd stole this man's moment? That's all. I just want to know. But I just want to get my quick thoughts about it. And tell me what y'all think.